hello guys welcome back to my channel so today we'll be looking at how to create a qr code scanner in flutter and first thing we need is add this in your dependency qr code scanner then after adding this there are some things you need to set up like going to your android and in your build gradle you set your kotlin version to 1.5.10 and then the build gradle to 4.2.0 after that, you go into your Android app and build Gradle and you make sure your minimum SDK version is 20. Then you go into your Gradle wrapper and the Gradle properties and have Gradle 6.9 or dot zip. And now we are through with the setup, so let's go into our code and start coding. So here I will create a container which will hold my scanner. I give it a height of 400 and a width of 400. Okay, so and the child will be QR view. So in my QR view, I have two required properties: the on QR created and the key. Let's quickly create the key over here. So yeah, I'll have final global key. Global key equals to global key. Okay, let me change this to key. All right, so this is the key we'll use for our QR global key. Then on QR created, so for this, we need a controller and the function. The controller will be QR view controller will be equals to controller. Okay, and then we need something for the results. So barcode equals to results. And then for our QR on QR created function, let's create the function void QR. And in the function, we'll make use of the controller. So we say QR view controller controller. And here we have this dot controller is equals to controller because we'll be using the controller in this function. Then we'll call it controller dot scanned data stream dot listen. All right, and inside here we have our set state. because we need to set the event or uh, you set the result equals to the event we get after scanning the code event or command event all right and here yeah, we're almost true with this qr code so Let's just have it here. QR. Okay. So if I should save this now. Okay. I think I'm having an error. Okay. And if I save this now. First thing we'll see here. Is that it needs to add. It needs permission to record and take photos so i'll just click on while using this app and here is our qr scanner so how to get the result from the qr scanner i'll create a text a text here which will be in the center and i'll say child over here results is not 
equals to null if result is not null then it should that will give me the result so here yeah, i'll have results dot result dot code the code from the result and since this is not labeled we will add this else if it is null then it should give me a text widget saying scan a code and this is what we have over here so we're having errors let me see where the error is coming from Oh, we have this inside our container, my bad. So remove this and put it outside the container. All right. And if I should restart. Let me check my app. So since the result is not, we have scan a code. Now, I don't have a code to scan, but I have this website that generates QR code for me, qr.io, and I've generated this code. So let's see what it will give me. I have my phone over here, and if I should scan, The code says subscribe to the channel. Well, it's not me. The code says it and obey the code. So this is just how to create a QR code scanner in Flutter. If you enjoyed this video, kindly do what the QR code says. Also like this video and I'll see you in the next lesson. The source code will be in the description below. Thanks for watching. Bye.